All right, uh, Lunar Chinese Year, uh, Series Autumn. Let's go ahead and have a look at these speed zones. Now we have three speed zones, all require an A800 Link and Co. We're going to see how far we can get with just the one car tuned, and we will work our way through. And if we need to mix it up, I'll put it in the video and let you know, of course. Um, so we'll have a tune right up on the screen in the next second or so that you'll be able to see what we're running, and we'll go from there. Now, first one, switchbacks. That's up in the hill area here. We're expected to run a 144.8 kilometer an hour average. Uh, so we're going to go ahead and see what we're able to do with this one. Let's go ahead and have a shot. So what we're going to try and do here is we're going to run from this angle here and get some speed because it's round about here to here is where the um, markers are for the average zone. Uh, and again, 144.8. Let's go, have a shot. Turn around when it is safe to do so. I reckon we've cleared it. First one done. Excellent. In those corners, don't go full for leather power in the corners. If you need feel the car starting to pull away from you, lightly tap on and off the brake just enough that you can get around. My car's got traction stability off as well, if that, uh, you're wondering what's my car running as well on those settings. On to the next one. All right, where do we go from here? speed zone ring ring road so we're on this one at the top of the stadium then by the looks uh, this particular one off memory if I'm not mistaken the best route whilst we would flag uh, where was it something like that for the finish on it you'd want to try and cut the corner because you get speed coming around here and then you just take it you go hard, but you, you go easy at the same time. You know what I mean. You're not going to... But yeah, because when you look where the start is, it's just around this mark. So we're going to go drop here. Now, I didn't mention the speed on this one that you needed, so I better let you know the speed. Speed for this one is 140. Um, all right. Let's go ahead and have a bit of a crack. Ignore the actual little kick, you're just going to take this side here because it's a smoother transition in. You lose less speed. We will power this car around. Get around here. the corner a little no break in there keep on accelerating you have arrived at your destination and we completed it just like that so this car is a solid performer I mean it's a fucking race car let's be real <laughs> okay with that let's head on to the next one for you uh, let's see let's see what have we got? Speed zone cliffside. Oh, uh, this one. If, if this is what I'm thinking, maybe it's not. Oh no, I was thinking it might have been. There's one around here somewhere that was a real pest with the township. But this one here, I think we may be good on. Now let's have a look. Not much speed up we can get here. I'm going to say we're going to start from here probably. And then we'll work our route down to here. 
that sounds like the most logical element. Now, what do we need? 177 kilometers an hour. All doable. Okay, we're here and we're ready to give this a shot. Go you car, go race car. Roadside there, not exactly what we were uh, wanting. This car really grips the road, really solid. That's the thing. That should give us the win. Boom. So, all three speed zones, all three use the same tune. Uh, all had traction and stability off. This is the winner car. Uh, car type you want to run a 2020 Link Co number 100 Cyan Racing 03. What a piano key mouthful of a car name. But that's what I ran. <laughs> um, Alright, well, I'm going to leave it there. Hopefully this video has helped you out. Uh, let me know if you prefer these in like an all three in one. Uh, I normally do these videos individually. Um, I really appreciate the feedback below, but if having three speed zones in one as opposed to three videos is more useful, more friendly, uh, yeah, let me know. Um, I'm just trying to get a bit of a gauge because obviously I need to do a lot of seasonals each week and it does... Um, does help me out with that feedback all right well anyway i'm gonna go and get a coffee or something now i think i've covered most of them i oh, know i've got fours of thon to do yet then i can do this all right thank you again have a great day